Hello everyone, Teacup Tempest here, and today we are doing part two of my Deep Slate house build, and we are going to be putting on the roof. I think I will reserve the interior for a part three. Uh, I, I just, I want to really walk you guys through how to do the roof. It is a little bit let me just throw stuff a little bit more complex let me get into the camera mode a lot and i just want to be sure you guys will be able to do this and have a true block by block where i'm not fast forwarding through certain parts and i will be putting these windows in as well but i like to do the flat part, like this part of the roof, all the way across, and then add these in afterwards. So keep that in mind that I will be doing that. And for the roof, you will need, I don't have it in here, but the deep slate brick, the polished deep slate, the warped plank, the warped stair, the crimson stair, tiled um deep slate tiles the slab version and the stair as well as the wall you will need the i believe this is light gray stained glass uh let me double check that for you yes light gray stained glass and the crimson trap door and we are going to start with our deep slate tile and on the left hand side of the build I like to start over here and then bring it forward and run it all the way across like so let's go ahead and do this in the back and you just want to connect everything up to the tower where you can and around the corner okay let's start with the roof frame you're going to be using the tile stair and the deep slate tiles for this so let's start with the stair and then immediately behind the stair put a deep slate tile and then a stair that's how this roof is going to start. From here, we're going to start doing something a little different for the rest of the way up. So let's go ahead and put in this little bit all the way around. So that way it is easier for you. So let's place our stair immediately behind the stair, the tile block. And then on top of that, the stair. Let's do the same thing on this side. Stair, tile block, stair, and again, the stair, tile block, and stair. If I go a little fast for you, be sure to like pause the video, rewind, do what you need to do. Okay, at this point, and let me double check myself here. Yes, all right. So let's start on this left hand side again and right behind this block, the full block, put an upside down stair and then on top of this upside down stair, place two full blocks. And then on top of this full block, place a stair. Okay? And again, behind this uppermost tiled block place an upside down stair and you'll notice these stairs will make a 90 degree and again two blocks and on top a stair and again behind this full block an upside down stair deep slate tile blocks with a stair on top 
you want to stop once you get toward the middle so I have room to do one more here so upside down stair tile blocks and a stair on top okay now we are in the center let's do this on this side so behind this full block upside down stair place two full blocks and a stair on top of that behind the uppermost tiled block place an upside down stair and then two on top and a stair on top of that oh don't tell me i've messed something up maybe not okay and then upside down two okay now nah, we're good oops and then a stair on top of that and then upside down two full blocks and a stair between these two upper stairs place an upside down block and then let me look and see what kind of flare i put on this let's see if it okay so here facing out from your build put put a right side up stair and behind it put an upside down and then on top of that put a right side up stair is that what i did seems like i did okay yeah i just left it like that no i didn't what did why does this look different no it is this way okay i'm just crazy today you could also do this if you want that's what i was fussing about there <laughs> now we have the left hand side of our builds roof frame made and that's how it, that should look let's continue this on the other side uh, just doing the frame makes everything so much easier so let's put our upside down stair two blocks on top of that and stair block on top of that uppermost tile block put an upside down stair and then two tiled blocks on top of that and then a, a stair on top of that and again uppermost tiled stair place an upside down uppermost tiled block place an upside down stair and two full blocks and then a stair on top of that i have room to do one more so upside down stair two tiled blocks and a stair there all right so let's do this side and do an upside down stair two blocks upside down stair upside down right side up upside down two blocks right side up upside down two blocks right side up upside down two blocks and right side up and then here do an upside down stair facing out from your build place an upright and then an upside down and then an upright okay now we have the frame of the roof made now it is a simple process of putting in your warp stairs but at this point i actually want to do this part so it looks like i came in two and in every two i went down for a space of three in the middle okay so where this stair is place a tile place another tile below that place a tile and then out from that place a tile place another tile let me make it daytime for us i can type today there we go below this one place a tile to the left place a tile to the left place a tile 
Okay, as you can see, we got two, two, two. I believe it's here where I did three. But, okay, so below, place a tile. To the left, place a tile. And to the left, place a tile. What I want to do at this point, just to make sure I'm doing this right, let's start over here. And place a tile to the right. Place a tile to the right. Place a tile below. One to the right. One to the right. One below. One to the right. One to the right. One below. Uh, one to the right. One to the right. And one below. And then let's start over here. One below. One to the left. One to the left. And one to the left. And it should look just like that. And if you wanted, you could make a little point here, but I left mine flat. And now, let's start filling in the stairs. And we just run these between the stairs. And we grab our work. Oh, not yet. <laughs> and then connect up these stairs. Here. Okay, and now we grab our work planks and run those across. In fact, I'm gonna start here too. It makes placing down the stair blocks a little quicker. And you can totally do this while standing here. So if you're on top of your roof and survival, you can totally do this. Okay. Place down the stairs. And I may actually need also the link version of the board. Let's see here. Yes. So I will make that amendment here. You will also need the link. Okay. Let's continue on placing our stairs. And really for the roof, you're going to be doing like a, a fill in the blank kind of thing with it. So I notice I stopped right there because I want to keep at least one tile above all the way along so one two three four five may have gone a little too far here yeah so let's break that one for now and continue on one two three four five okay And then let's run our stairs all the way down here. Okay, I am gonna have to remember how I did this. A stair works fine here. Let's do our slab there. Let's see. I did two stairs, two slabs. So slabs okay and from here there's a full block oh okay i'm going to go ahead and put a full block of the warped here but whenever we put in the windows i'll be changing that so if you wanted to go ahead and be preemptive you can okay now let me do this side. So I'll place two stairs, two slabs for that part. And then from here, we got stairs all along here. And then it looks like I put some full blocks here, or maybe even slabs, and then slabs on top of that. So 
Let's do slab, 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 slab. And then if you look right here, you can place slabs there. And there you have it. Let's do the other side and then we'll come back around to put in the windows. So fill in everything. And whenever you're connecting up to the tower, you can do stuff like this. So it connects up. And then the full block. Okay. And this way you don't have any holes leading into your house. block let's grab our stairs full block two three four five and six and this will go all the way across so I will go ahead and do that okay let's come back around here and do the stairs all the way across. Okay. Back over here. Let's do two stairs and two slabs. And then here, two slabs here. And then like on the others, oops. Like on the other side, we place these three like so, and then two, I keep falling today, two slabs. Okay, let's start working on this. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then two stairs, two slabs. And there you have this side of the roof, except for this bit. And let's fill this in. Hope you all are having a lovely day today. Be sure to like and subscribe. I post Minecraft videos every week, usually on Fridays, unless my chronic pain is flared up like it did this week. Alright. We have the roof. Let me check. I did one stair up and three stairs over. So, let's start on the left hand side. Let's go up a stair block over three stair blocks and break out three i believe that's what i did i may actually have done five i did do five this time so let's break out five all right let's go over to the right hand side go up a stair over three and break out five i think that was four one two three four five okay so you should have three warped, face of five, three warped, face of five, three warped. And then I used the deep slate bricks. One, two, three, I'm trying to remember, four, yes, so four. So one, two, three, Four. Let me change the time. And there you have that part. Let's break out these. And then this stair immediately behind the block. As well as this one. Grab your warped stair and bring this around. And same thing here. On top, place two stairs like so. And on top of this, place two stairs. Okay. 
Let's go ahead and grab our tile. Place one like so. Place an upside down one and one on top of that. And then line these two stairs up and place one. Uh, let's do it upside down and place one like this. Let's go ahead and place our upside downs and our right side ups and then one upside down between the two upper stairs and then facing away place a right side up stair and you have that now let's grab our warped uh, stair again bring that over break the stair right there so it all connects and do the same thing here and that should connect. Now let's grab our deep slate uh, tile slab, bring that all the way across, and then let's break out those and place this, uh, the full block, the stair, and the full block. Okay, let's take our, if I have it, I do not. Let's take our polished deep slate and let's bring that all the way up and if you don't have a block there just place it beside this one and bring it all the way up I'm gonna break out that block okay let's see oh that's our house all right while we have the polished place one here and place one right there grab I don't have the crimson on me so let me grab that um, I don't need the glass just yet place an upside down crimson stair place a right side up crimson stair and I will come back to this point to put in the windows and the uh, the uh, trap door um, my inventory is just kind of full on my hotbar. Well, I don't really need the warped anymore. So let's go ahead and grab what I need to finish this. Um, I actually used the pane. So let me amend this further and put a little... Oh, and it looks like I used the dark... Oh, it's because I grabbed the wrong pane. Derp. There we go. Some days it's a struggle. Okay. Let's try this again. Three times a charm, right? Alrighty. So let's place this in our window. Grab our trap doors and place them like so. That's a nice little pop of color against all the gray. Let's do the same thing on the right hand side. So starting with your bricks, bring it up by four. So one, two, three, and four. Break out the three in between. Break out the stairs immediately behind the uppermost brick block. And then let's grab our, I do need the warped stair. Let's grab our warped stair, place one right here. Place those on top. And come on this side and do the same thing. Place the stair there so it connects. And place them right there. Let's grab our deep slate tile, tile stair. Place it here. And then upside down. And place the right side up on top of that. Do the same thing on the other side. Upside down and our right side up. Let's place upside down stairs here and then right side up on those and then an upside down stair between the two uppermost stairs and then facing out from your build. Place an upright stair right there. Okay, now let's grab our warped stairs and place them like so. Break out this stair that's kind of behind and to the right and do... The same placing of the stairs over here 
Let's grab our tile slab and run that across. Break out this full block, this stair, this full block, and replace it with the tiled version. And there you have it. Okay. Let's grab our polished deep slate and run this all the way up on both sides. And like I said, if you don't have a block to place it on, just set it to the side and run that all the way up as well. At the bottom, place one. At the top, place one. Let's grab our crimson stair, place it upside down, a right side up. Let's grab our stained glass, place a couple of those, and then let me grab the trap door and place a couple of those. And now we have the windows on our house. Now, to complete this, we will want to go over here and on the opposite side, do the same thing all the way down we want to place tiled so let's go ahead and run this all the way up because i think that ultimately looks better than this side but this is up to you. You can do this or not. It's really whatever you think. I felt it looked a little better, so that's why I did it. And let's see. Full that is not a full block. Spear. Full block. And stairs. Okay. Now we have the main roof on the house. While I have these particular blocks, and before I get started on the tower roof, let's go ahead and do this part. For this part, you are going to also need the stripped warp stem. I think that's the only real addition outside of the crimson uh, fence. This is totally up to you what you want to do here. This is just what I decided to do. And then yeah, you'll need the tile to run across. So let's get going on that. Let's start on the left hand side of the bill. Actually. Let me go back and look real quick. So I started with the polished, then I did the stem. Okay. Alrighty. So let's just fill that in like so. And then over here, one, and then one, two. Now let's grab our stem and run this up there. And do the same on the opposite side. Let's grab our polished and run it all the way up. Same here. And then work stem all the way up on this. Let me change the time so you can see better. And connect it up there. Okay. It looks like I took, and I don't have it on me, looks like I took stone brick, did three, and then I did one, two, three stone brick at the top. Okay. So let's place our stone brick here. I decided to continue with the stone brick just because it just looked nicer. But you can also do polished here as well. And then one, two, three. Let's do our upside down crimson stair. Let's do a right side up. 
And I don't think I do not. Um, I don't think I need this. So let me grab a pane. And let's fill this in. One, two, three. And then let's grab our trap doors and place three of those. Like so. Let's take our deep slate tile and on the upper half of these stone bricks, all the way across, you want to run this. Okay. There's that and then let's go through the other side. And let's start with our polished one, one, two. On the other side, same thing. One, one, two. Let's grab our warp stem and bring that all the way up. And then let's grab our polished again and bring that all the way up. Alright. And then on either side, bring the warp stems all the way up. Okay, now let's grab our brick, place one here, and place uh, four technically, so one, two, three, four. I forgot a detail on the other side that I will add when I get done here. Upside down, crimson stair, right side up, crimson stair. Let's grab our, um, that the spot, our trap doors. Let's take our tiled all the way across. And then the last detail you need to add is the stair, or the fence. And then I put a little lantern right there. So let me grab that. Okay. Let's do the same thing over here. I still replaced my fence, didn't I? And one, two, and a lantern. Alright. Now we have all of the roof and the ends complete. Let's work on this roof. It's the same style as I did for the towers. So if you watched that particular video, you know what's up. So let's grab our slab. And then I believe I just used slabs all the way up until I got to this point. Okay, so let's get to work. I'm going to rearrange this a little bit. Okay, let's just start by running the tile all the way around. Oh, <laughs> Disregard, disregard. Let's start on the left hand side. I was about to do a different style on you guys. And let's do one, one, two, one, two, one, two. So now we're in the center. And then let's go one below, one below, and there. Let's place an additional one on either side. And let's go to the left side. Place one here. And then go one, two, one, two, one, two. And then one below, one and one below, and one there. Okay, let's place a couple right here, and then one, two, one, two, one, two, until we get to that center point, and then one, one below, one, one below, and one right there. Place one additional here, and then one, and then one, two, one, two, one, two, until we get to the middle, and then one, 
one below, one, one below, and one. So this is how this should look. Let's go ahead and bring up the uh, the frame of it. So I believe I immediately started up with it. Yeah. So one, two, one, two, one, two, until you get to a center point, and then do the same on this one. One, two, one, two, one, two. Then one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And then I like to do a full block here because I usually do a chandelier, place two more. And then I will go grab the wall and come back and place that on top like so let's take our warped slab and just run a single layer all the way around like so i go into more detail on how to and i'll try to remember to put a card in here so you can go directly to that video but go into more detail how to build this particular roof whenever I do the tower build but the gist is you want each one to be one up so you got this block and you got one up from it now let's place two slabs here and now from this one it's one up let's do the same thing for this one and oh yeah you do want to do that and this one and now that's one up and now we need one up for these two so come in here do the same thing and then just keep bringing them up like so and if you notice it's all one up from one another and let's continue and there and here and let's come kind of in the inside and do that like so and then here 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 like that all right and now we got one more side so place two here and then back like that and then like so until you get all the way up all right now we have the roof of that tower made one thing you do want to make sure is to go around and make sure we got those filled in which we do okay see how long this video is already uh yeah 40 42 minutes <laughs> i kind of figured this would take a while i will be back to do the interior of this build and i hope you found this roof tutorial uh, pretty straightforward I am hitting my mid-afternoon slump and I'm getting a headache, so hopefully I explained this all well enough for you. If you have any questions, be sure to let me know. And yeah, like and subscribe. This is all I've got for you today. Look for part three for the interior next week. We get to build our little Harry Potter bedroom. <laughs> So yeah, that's all I got for you. Have a wonderful weekend. Until next time, goodbye.